Welcome back to Senshinochi. I am Shinitsuki and on today's video, I will be teaching you guys how to uh, cheat being a good colorist. So yeah, since many of y'all are uh, really lazy about painting your art, I am going to be teaching you guys the uh, easiest, the easiest way to paint your art pretty or more watercolorish like. So there is this option in the A part known as the auto paint so we are going to use it once you click onto it it's going to automatically paint all over your art like like those fantasies come true but the main downfall is that it only uses a yellowish tone so it's not going to be very likable right so we are going to choose the uh, desired color that we want like uh, i'm choosing green for the hair i'm going to make some lines over the part where i need the green like this all right uh, follow me follow what i'm doing so once i do this it's going to automatically paint it green or greenish right so yeah but this green has spread all over right so we are going to use a clothing color right now like some more lines over the clothing area and click paint so when we wait it's going to paint it uh, purple right and yeah that's very good and now the skin is one of the main problems because it's very yellowish greenish and purplish so we're going to choose the uh, desired skin color and just dots over the skin parts like this and once we do that and click paint it's going to give us the skin color it's very pretty right now and then for the earrings i'm going to choose the yellow and make dots again so whenever you want a specific color in your line art you're just going to make some dots over it and it's going to be done right so i'll make some red for the eyes like this and then i'll click paint this is going to paint all over the eyes but it's also going to paint over the skin so that that's when we are going to use the skin color again so i'm going to choose the places where it painted red and i'm going to put the skin color over it so it neutralizes right and then i'm going to use the uh, same green over the eyebrows uh, this is not the same green but anyways uh, the app's kind of crashing so yeah it's not working so don't worry about these lines that just stay there because i've got a once you click the tick button it's going to go away like this so now that uh, it has painted it pretty gracefully we're just going to uh, adjust the art a bit for it to be a bit more lookable and pretty because it certainly is not right at the moment and the ears of course the ears because we need the ears not to look like the grinch how the grinch stole the christmas and yeah so yeah we are going to be uh, adjusting the art a bit because the AI is not very accurate. It's not a human. It wouldn't know where is the eyelashes and where the eyes are. So we are just going to adjust it a bit. And mm -hmm. we are going to adjust it a lot more. Not just a bit. Like this. And yeah. Uh, you can just... Uh, again use the multiply layer and do some basic stuff you know to make your art look a bit more pretty like this so mm -hmm. that's how you adjust your art so that it looks kinda lookable like this mm-hmm and uh, a little bit of airbrush on the edges and we are done so uh, this is this isn't that lookable but it's uh, very useful for small drawings and casual art so um, yeah that's just how auto paint works it's not very efficient but it's uh, kind of decent i guess uh, if you like my content then like share subscribe and comment below what you'd like to see on the next video thank you bye